Hey everyone, welcome back. In today's video, I am going to discuss why do people think software testing job is easy. Now I'll be covering four very important points why people think that it's an easy job, okay? And how you as a tester can make sure that you are providing the right information to your stakeholders so that this misconception starts to get over or end from now on. It has been there for for decades right people think software testing is easy why it is easy they have no idea or it's their own personal experience so I'll be covering very important four points go ahead watch this video until end so that you can make sure that when you are working in software testing projects you are ensuring that you are doing justice and this particular misconception starts to get over from the industry from here on okay the first and foremost thing i'll be a little harsh here there are a bit of our group of people who think software testing is easy because they haven't done the work really right they haven't actually worked either in software testing first thing or if they have worked in software testing, they have worked for a very brief period of time and they were just longing to get promoted to lead and manager and somehow they got promoted to lead and manager and they just started getting work done from people but by just pushing you know the team so they haven't really had the real hands-on knowledge and the overall grinding that is required to do the real software testing work so that's the first category of people who think that software testing is easy job okay second category of people who think software testing is easy easy job would be the people who themselves haven't had or any experience or they are from some other departments and they have heard from someone that yeah software testing software testers don't do much or it's basically just click 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 and the ui flow and that's that's it right so that's another category of people who might think or who have got misinformation from some other people okay second thing or second reason why people or why your managers might come up and it's not just test managers or leads it's basically sometimes I have seen the project managers who are the people who work on the budget as well project budget as well so in order to save money right they will come to you and they'll try to grill you down and they'll say what is in the testing right what are you going to test it's simple flow it's this that right so that's obvious and that's always going to remain there they don't mean it they don't mean that software testing is easy it's just that they want to put a little pressure and they do it for the developers they do do it for everyone else right so this is not that they don't know the value of software testing if they wouldn't know the software value of software testing we as a testers wouldn't have been there in the project first thing okay so they know the value but then to basically make sure that you are giving the right estimates and actually you are able to explain the complexity and the details that are required in that particular project that is what they want to listen sometimes there is another this category of people who will grill you down or maybe ask questions to ensure that you understand things well and you are going to test the product properly okay that's the second very important point now the third important point why people think software testing is an easy job is you as a tester within the project why because if you are a person within a project who doesn't collaborate who doesn't communicate within the team who doesn't talk and ask questions who doesn't go through the documentation well doesn't understand the end-to-end -end picture and is not willing to basically learn and upskill right that obviously puts an impression that you are not actually providing any value add right apart from just getting the build and executing some of the test cases that you have documented you are not doing any other value add to the project right actually software testing is not just a phase it's the full in full sdlc you should be involved right from the requirement phase and should be providing the value so that you are preventing the defects and not just a person who just wants to 
find some defects and lock those defects and disappear right so you need to ensure that your you are upskilling yourself you are making sure that you are collaborating with the team you are very uh, proactively involved and providing the real value to the team as a tester okay if you can upskill yourself once you are in the project you can upskill yourself with the api testing you can upskill yourself uh, in the ui automation try to do the side work or some uh, any any monotonous work or any basically the work that is repetitive try to automate that right that is the value add that you should be bringing into the project as a tester now the last point that i want to cover is that sometimes the person has experience with a very simple project right so maybe people have worked on very simple project wherein there was very less complexity and testers were doing their job well but then because the project nature was itself very less complex then they felt that testing is easy because the project was simple and testing was simple as well so if person has just gone through simple projects and they have their experience that testing will be simply simpler for any other you know project or every other project that is another reason why people might feel that software testing is a easy job now when i say software testing is an easy job or it's not an easy job right the reason being that software testing is not just about documenting test cases executing them and reporting defect it's a lot more than that right and industry needs to know that and you as a tester are the one who is who has the capability and ability to change it we as a tester know end to end about any project right developers don't know we know end to end we can take the lead in showcases uh, to show the functionalities to the business to take a lead to automate take a lead to guide the developers on what to cover basically whenever they are writing the code for a particular functionality right so all of these ideas that you will provide will eventually help the team and you will gain more respect and people will by default understand the importance of you within the team and importance of testing within the team all right so these are four key points remember these and you are the one as a tester who is going to change this particular feeling and perception within the industry so i hope this was helpful video thank you very much for watching